Okay, so today we're going to be looking at our Runshin F75 A1 backwash valves. These are our full industrial automatic backwash valves. So please keep in mind these will only fit on 14 by 65 and larger FRP vessels. These are full 2 inch or 50 mil fittings and it's a 4 inch um, bottom fitting that fits onto your uh, FRP vessel. So just running through different settings on the unit, it is quite a large unit so uh, I'm just going to hold it here with both hands. It works in exactly the same way as our smaller units, the F70, uh, uh, F67 and uh, F63 sort of units. Firstly, you'll see it's locked at the moment, so we push both buttons to unlock. And we then go into our settings menu. Firstly, it's the time. We can push enter over here, change the time, hour, minute. Next, we have the backwash time in the morning. Then we push enter, we can change it, hours and minutes. Um, next, we have F01. Or, oh, sorry, F00. So, again, this is the number of times that the backwash cycle repeats um, each time that the unit runs. So, for most people, this is going to be sufficient. It's just going to be once. Um, next, we have this is the frequency. So, this is uh, every third day. If, again, if you want to change that, you can change this depending on what the frequency is that you'd like the unit to backwash. After that, we have the backwash time. So, the duration of the backwash. You can see there it's showing arrows upwards, so it's a backwash, and this is 10 minutes. Um, you can change that again depending on the media that you're running or the size of the vessel that you have. Next we have the rinse cycle, again on exactly the same basis, you can change that as you need to. After that we have VO1, again um, this is more of an industrial setting, for most people just the VO1 is going to be fine and then we are back at the time. So just as with the other units, you then push this finger again to get it back in operations mode. If this light is pulsing and that little hourglass is lit up, it means that the unit is running. Um, if you'd like to override the timer and do a manual backwash cycle, you can then push this little button with it looks like a finger that's pointing. It's gonna run through, do a backwash cycle. There we go, as we set it, 10 minutes, it's running its backwash. Push it again, we're gonna go through to the rinse cycle. There we go, it's on its fast rinse cycle for 10 minutes. And pushing it again, we go back to the operations mode. There we go, so the system is then running and it will then start counting down on its timer again. Uh, if you have any more technical questions or if you are unsure of anything, you are welcome to give us a call at our office on 021-851-0133 or you can uh, email us at sales at defendantwater.ca.za.